I don't want to set the world on fire. Hello, this is Genosis with episode 21 of The Wasteland World on Fire. I think we can go ahead and update the sign to one day since we set something or someone on fire. So, uh, we'll, uh, today's horror day, so I doubt we will go another day. So, uh, let's uh, have a few topics of conversation here. So, first of all, I, uh, I'm I've been looking at this whole nuclear fat man launcher thing, which does, uh, what does it say? 1,333 damage. So that's terrifying. So I want to test that out today. Now, when I was actually looking at the um, making more ammunition, so it, the, I can make more nukes. I had a fair bit of nuclear material I've been looting from mutants and raiders and all that. And I was able to craft 10 more of those beauties. And I finally crafted a laser rifle. I've been uh, seeing that come up and our crucible is done. So now we can craft steel, which is pretty important uh let's see um other than that get some glue crafting here i'd like to get maybe a better pickaxe a steel pickaxe now that i can make that uh i just need some more steel so we get that we'll get that pumping yeah well let's go take a look at the base and see what uh fortifications we can do 304 steel it's uh yeah today is going to be our ideally our last horde night here and then we're going to find a new base location change things up a bit uh, relocate, talk to your new trader, and uh, come up with a different different strategy. Okay, so I was actually looking at the nukes. The explosion damage, which is to entities, is 1,250. The block damage, 2,500. So you don't fire this at your horde base. You fire this away from your base. You fire it, like, right over there. <laughs> Okay, that's a decent test. I'm glad we did that. <laughs> Let's uh, take a little closer look at the damage. Oh, yeah. Surprise. Oh, geez. Some bone left over. <laughs> this is... That is brutal. I mean, I'm glad I'm moving. Because that just seems irresponsible to leave that there. Wow. So maybe maybe we'll uh, toss one of these at like a group of raiders from a, a, a great distance. That would be fun. All right, now for traps, I don't believe we can make the blade trap yet. No, I need more trap points. Ooh, the Mark II, very nice. Uh, soldering, wait, don't I have a soldering something or other? Soldering station, is that what goes there? No, okay. Oh, that's the precision workbench, uh, which I can craft. I just need a ton of steel. Well, good thing I'm crafting a ton of steel. That's just gonna take some time. So we'll let that go throughout the day. Um, I guess I'll just top it off with iron. Yeah, top it off with some iron and clay. And uh, then we'll actually craft some electrical posts. There we go, electrical post. Let's see, I'm going to need 12 more. But let's pop that up to 16 more. Because I want to be able to fill in all of those four corners, electrical wiring. All right, one other thing I noticed is that the Duke collectors no longer give me... Um, clean water it gives me now murky water there was a comment some time ago that says that hey i'm only getting murky water in mine but that's because i didn't have my version updated so now it's murky so that's just this is great all right uh oh um let's get, get some uh some cement going and i don't want to overdo the cement on uh, on the horde base because again it's going to be just for tonight but i think we can uh, just get some mining with my pickaxe which will be coming here eventually but we'll take what we have and see what we can do with it. Oh, one other thing. I did loot this last night at the um, uh, Super Duper Mart. I just wanted to mention it before reading it. Um, easier to find... Makes it easier to find better loot. So uh, let's see which one that was. Yeah, there it is. 10% to game stage. Well, that's nice. All right, let's uh, do some upgrading. Damn, I'm hungry. Oh! <laughs> no way! He's still there. I am surprised. I thought sure I thought sure they were gonna despawn, but I am pleasantly but I am pleasantly surprised I didn't.
All right, I did everything two levels up all the way around. So that should be sufficient for tonight. I don't think I need to do more than that. That's a little, uh, a little damaged. Uh, that will repair that shortly. But yeah, I think that'll be fine for tonight because I'm going to need all kinds of resources uh, when we start a new build uh, the next day. So yeah, I think that'll be sufficient. I don't know if I'll need to get into the steel. I think I think not. So we'll have all the ammunition and Molotovs and everything I'll need tonight to keep these zombies at bay. It would be super nice if I could find another one or two of the uh, brothers so I can uh, get a full full squad going. All right, there's the steel pickaxe. That's coming. I'm not going to bother with the auger at level two. I'll wait a little bit for that. Um, now, should I... Hmm. Should I do a little bit of touring around to see if I can find another... Uh, do you, wait, wait, wait. Can I could go to the rad cats. I don't suppose I have enough of the tokens. I have 16. I have enough to hire, but I also need 100 to craft a reward. And I kind of want to know what that is. So I, I am tempted to just, just lay off on that. All right, you know what? I'm going to go ahead and check the trader, see if there's anything of interest. And uh, then we'll maybe tour around the town a little bit. Oh, sorry. Tour around the town a little bit and see if I can uh, do any recruitment. All right, howdy, Bob. Well, howdy do, friend. Uh, let's see. I'll just check the quests. Fort Chopper. Well, U.S. Army Post. Army Post. Okay, nah. nah. Never mind. Let's check your inventory, though. Okay, I'm going to buy some uh, Tech Planet. I'm going to buy some wiring. Home cooking. That's a good thing to get. And right, I think that's it. I'm going to double check. Uh, spotlight, motion sensor, vending machine. A uh, shotgun auto turret would be tempting, but that's a lot of goddamn money. Quintuple pocket mod. I think I'm okay being very minorly encumbered for now. I can make mortar and pestles. Yeah, just checking to see if there's anything here. A uh, cooking utensils is something apparently that I need in order to speed things up at the campfire. So that is another thing I'll have to keep an eye out for. All right, no, I think that is it. So home cooking. So yucca juice and snowberry smoothies. Wiring. Three of those. And Tech Planet. There. Didn't get anything new, but uh, at least uh, at least we're getting there. All right, just going to bring up the brothers just before we... Oh, you know what? There's something I'm curious about. So, let's see. Um, inventory. Um, <laughs> just I'm just curious. Just a little curious. Weapon menu. Other. Okay, no. It wouldn't be a pistol. Probably not a rifle. Use auto shotgun. Yeah, I, I, it was a suggestion in the comments, and I just had to check. Never mind. Just uh, give it back to me. I don't trust you with it. Hell, I don't trust me with it. All right, I'm also going to wrench stuff while I'm driving around town. Oh, is that Feral? Never mind. Um, yeah, I'm just going to wrench stuff around town, get some extra gas, extra supplies, just while I'm looking for brothers and whatnot. It's not a bad use of time. I mean, I'm waiting for a lot of steel to smelt. So I wouldn't mind getting some extra resources. Because when I leave this town... Uh, all of this stuff is just gonna it's just gonna be sitting here and no one's gonna be using it all right another thing I'm doing is definitely stopping for all of the police cars the loot has been a lot better than I thought they would be uh, usually at in the vanilla there's like maybe a few stray bullets uh, I don't even think I ever found a gun in there so uh, but here no there's definitely some good stuff in these all right and we win oh yeah 65 bullets parts weapon energy weapon parts which is important to me right now so that was pretty great wait did i pick up my laser rifle right i kind of want to try that out and maybe put some mods onto it i'll have to do that when i get back all right maybe what i'll do is uh check out another town uh is that worth do i like to check, check out the traders really uh there's jen uh there's the big rocket station hmm yeah, let's go ahead and talk to jen and see if she's got any uh deals on anything right now. I'm still looking for those cooking utensils and a couple other things. I'm really just kind of killing time waiting for uh, stuff to smelt. But yeah, once we hit this town, we'll come back and then check on all of our crafting situation back at the base. Ooh, hold on. Did I see this before? Adam Sedan. Five out of eight. Um, that's tempting. I'm going to mark it because it's something I don't have. Because I'm actually relatively sure I have all the parts for that. But yeah, we'll, we'll find out later. All right, another police car while I'm on the road. Uh, oh, actually, microfusion cell. Isn't that what I need for the laser rifle? It is. Oh, that looks fancy. Okay. Nice. Yeah, I'll get some mods into it later. And it is so weird not to immediately explode anything. Like, watch this. 
Bam. See that? Not exploded. <laughs> it is, I think they missed a zero when they were setting the uh, the health of this thing. Because they literally multiplied it by ten. So it must have been a must have been a typo. Alright, let's talk to Jen. Uh, do I happen to have my uh, conversation gun? Uh, yes, I do. Right here. Uh, may as well swap that with the laser rifle for now. Yeah, may as well just have it out just in case I want to buy something. Uh, well, to Jen? The oh yeah, there is nothing here of, uh, nothing here of interest. That's unfortunate. It kind of wasted of a trip. Alright, well, I guess we may as well return, because I've, I've done what I said I was going to do. I checked the traders, and there's not really much else I can do other than driving around. That seems like a waste. Oh, did I just <laughs> kick up some guts there? Uh, I'll do a, a little bit of a tour of the town just in case I see another, another brother, but otherwise, I guess we're just going to head home and enhance, you know, enhance things. Okay, do I know what building this is? This uh, seems to stick out to me. Oh, the police station. Mm, yeah, no, no, that's just, that just sounds like a distraction to me. Oh man, I made such a mess of this place. <laughs> All right, we're back home. Yeah, that was an uneventful trip, but I had to take a look, right? All right, so let's check the status of all this. And, oh, right, yeah, see, there, there it goes, murky water. So, uh, unfortunate, but I guess it's fine, it's fine. All right, so that's, uh, there's a little bit of glue there. Oh, yeah, there's the posts. That's one thing I was waiting for. So I really need to clean up my inventory here. All right, so we got the electrical posts, and we can get this place fully wired. Now, I'm going to do my best to try to get as much coverage as I can, but in the circular, I guess, style we're going for, that the um, wiring is not going to be super optimal. Is that just you guys? Okay. <laughs> But yeah, it'll be a lot better than it was. Oh, you being in there is going to be a bit of a problem. I'll uh, try to position them as best I can. Can you just move? Ugh. Oh, can I hire you? Oh. Uh, you know what? I'm going to do it. I'm going to spend the 10 caps and just hire him. Because I, I, I'm feeling a little bad. And honestly, that uh, him being in the way is kind of a problem. So this is a solution. All right, consider this a mercy, because I was going to leave you here for free labor. So, yes. And then pick you up. Perfect. Now, let's go find you a proper weapon. All right, we have all kinds of weapons here. So, what would be... What would be good? I don't know if they use laser weapons. A lever action might be fun. Uh, SMG would be really fun. AK-47. All right, I'm going to load you with an AK-47. What? Why the hell not? So, let's just... I don't know. I don't know if, I'm, if I need to keep a bullet in the inventory, but we're, we're gonna. All right, let's do our first rad cat, which is super cool. So, inventory. Here is your infinite bullets and uh, weapon menu. Oh, no, no. Weapons. Rifle. AK-47. Oh, yes. Uh, we're good. So, service rifle, auto shotgun, and AK-47. We're, we're in good company here. Uh, and actually, I wanted to use the 10 millimeter SMG for myself, because I would really like to see it in action. All right, uh, what are we doing? Okay, get the posts down. Now I need to do some wiring. And there's something else I thought. Right, I wanted to mod up the laser rifle. Now, how many mods can we get? Three is not bad. Three isn't bad, so let's see what we can get here. All right, as for modding, so we got the rad remover and the bipod mod. Uh, there is no magazine extension for that, unless there's, like, um, a laser magazine <laughs> extension. I don't know if that's a thing. I don't know. It doesn't seem to be. Oh, laser rifle scope. Oh, I didn't even know that was uh, <laughs> specifically a thing. Nice. What does that look like? Oh, that looks super cool. Okay, we are ready with that. So, uh, let's see. Laser rifle, 61 damage. It is significantly less damage than this, but... Uh, bigger magazine. Still, I mean, we're, we're going to use uh, all the bullets we can. All right, now to get everything else squared away, let's get all the wiring done. It's uh, going to be a little funky, so bear with me. I, 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 uh, uh, ah, you bugger. No, you're going to... Whoa. You are lucky I did not injure myself, you jackanape. Okay, pick me up. Okay, yeah, I definitely need... <laughs> I'm going to put all you guys in your positions so I don't have to worry about it later. All right, let's look at these guys' position one at a time here. So you, uh, and then I'm going to stand where you should be. Um, actually, how's that going to work? Mm. Okay, command menu, stay where I am standing. 
Okay, there we go. Hey, come here. Alright, they seem to be facing out, which is a good thing. But I was kind of told that... Uh, you know, actually move him a little bit more. I was told that they only face the direction that you were, but the, he looks fine. You know, these uh, these guys look they're in a good position. So, yeah, no worries. I My sentries are in place. Are you, you're going to turn around, right? Okay, we're all good. Everyone's everyone's good. Now I'll get this wiring done. I think I have this on a switch. Yeah. I'm just going to redo all the wiring. Ah, dang it. Redo, redo all the wiring so I know what's going on. All right, I think we're good. All right, let's take a look at the results. So there's three points of contact. Uh, that goes mixed a little bit. But I did that differently. Four. Uh, four. And four. Okay, so, yeah. That should be plenty. I just have to keep an eye on the uh, repairing the wires as I go. And I think it uses the nearby storage to repair things. Yes, it does. Okay. That is perfect. All right, now the wiring is done. I'm going to spend a little bit of time with my new steel axe and to get some extra stone because I'm going to need some more stone in order to get additional cement. All right, so I got about 8,800 8, stone. It's pretty quick because uh, I'm just one-shotting stone at this point, which is great. And I, I'm still actually vaguely tempered. Maybe I will get the auger because it's not like I have a shortage of motor tool parts. I don't. And uh, everything looks dead simple to craft. So well, what the hell? I'll go grab an auger. It, uh, if anything, will provide some entertainment if the uh, screamers get called. All right, there you go, auger. That's simple enough to make. It'll be done in a couple minutes. And I've been curious about something. So uh, the nail gun, uh, there was comments saying that the effective range of the nail gun goes up with a higher quality one. I'm going to wait to test that until it hits rank 5. And that would be an interesting uh, division of effectiveness. I never really considered that. So, yeah, I'll have to maybe get a better nail gun later. I was commenting how it doesn't really matter the quality. But I, apparently it does. Okay, you know what? Um, <laughs> I have to try this. We get human ravioli, uh, some mutant pie, and I guess I'll leave it at that. I'll need more. Yeah, I'll need more eggs. I think in order to cook some other stuff. So I'm curious to see what the benefits of this stuff is. It better be something, because if it like you know hurts you or something, that'd be messed up. I don't know. But apparently there was also a. Um, what was it called? Yeah, cannibal. Safe to consume raw human meat. Get some extra nutrition from cooked foods using those meats. Cook food using those meats faster. Gain the maximum nutrition from cooked foods using these meats. Cooked foods uh, using meats 50% faster to harvest more meat from corpses. So if you're really, really into eating people, this is where you want to be. All right, there's our first thunder crack. I'm just cleaning up the inventory a little bit. Uh, I left my drone over there because it's going to be a nuisance if I, if I try need to get some uh, supplies off of it. Um, I think that is... Yeah, just waiting for the food. Uh, getting some extra cement, but other than that, I think it's good. I may want to use some, some of the steel and do a little bit of reinforcement. Just a little bit. Not a whole bunch, because we do have 257 steel. Maybe we should at least protect the electrical wiring. Yeah, it's going to be about 80 steel. Oh, per side. That is... Oh, uh, we can almost make more. Yeah, definitely need some more. I used up everything, which is just typical. But yeah, let's get some more crafted. All right, just going to take a putter around. I'm sure uh, Fortnite is going to be appending here much more quickly than I thought it was going to. But I also need to uh, get our weapon situation straight now, making sure I have all the weapons I intend on using tonight. All right, I got 1,200 microfusion cells, 600 of the bulk. Uh, you get 600, 762. We have some railway spikes, but I think we'll be okay without it. And we are pretty much out of the plasma shots. I suppose we make more, but that's probably not worth it. I can just maybe grab some of, the, some of those. Yeah, I think it's all the uh, energy cells. Oh, hold on. Max charge plasma energy cell. So I do have some other ammo, some alternative ammo. We'll use that if we need to. But I believe the bulk of it is going to be the this laser rifle. Yeah, that's going to be a lot of fun. I'm going to grab a recog. And I'm also going to grab... I thought sure I had a learning elixir. Did I? Yes, I did. Perfect. All right, let's check the food situation here. Oh, okay, hold on. It's minus health. But it gives me... That doesn't seem really worth it at all. Why did I waste anything on that? Huh. I mean... I already made it. it would be a waste, so 
Down the hatch. Gross. Let's never do that again. Let's make some regular old meat stew to get the taste out of my mouth. All right, just for funsies, I'm going to make a few spotlights and uh, try to get them positioned before Horde Night starts. It only takes 10 seconds to craft these. I sh <laughs> should have a little bit of time. But it would be nice if I can get a little bit more uh, visual acuity as I'm uh, playing through the night. All right, got all four of them. So we have a very little time to get these positions. So how do I want to get these? Uh, where would be a good spot? Okay, we're just going to put them like... Yeah, like, like, like that. There we go. Now to get them wired. All right, last of them is wired. Let's flip the switch. Oh, and turn the generator on. There we go. So everything's under control. Um, yeah, let's position that. It okay, will point that right in the middle and do that for each side. Here we go. Right, things are starting and that is done. Cool. All right, so let's get some Molotovs out. Don't need that. Need that there. And let's get the laser rifle. Okay, let's get the shenanigans under underway. You guys gonna get shot there or something? There we go. Okay, this is gonna go just fine. Keep shooting them, fellas. Yeah, laser gun's pretty effective. Just trying not to waste any ammo, but yeah, it's uh, finishing him off just fine. Lots of electricity going on. Man, it's loud. Ooh, I feel so in control. I got my turrets going. I got my brothers going here. Seeing a few new zombies. The pumpkin head down there. Oh yeah, we're uh, yeah, we're doing just fine. We seem to do a lot of activity here, so let's do the Molotov thing. Bam! Yeah, that'll do just fine. Ooh, almost forgot the learning elixir. Um, bum, 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 bum. There we go. I also want to try the 10 millimeter because I'm curious about that. Get 1,200 bullets for this, so I am not... I should not need to be shot. Oh, yeah. Oh, I like it. Man, they're barely getting to the base. <laughs> they're just, uh... dying on the way here. Oh, ooh, I got a... radiation hit from somebody. There you are. None of that now. Gotta say, it's feeling pretty in control. Like, if you don't hear... The electric wire sound? That means they haven't got that close. So that's that's a sound of success. Right, I think it is Molotov time. There's a enough of these guys kicking around. Right there should be fine. Maybe another one over here for good measure. Yeah, everyone just run right through if you don't mind. Thank you. Uh, we broke our gun. So what uh, does it take to repair? Okay, it takes pistol parts. Okay, note that for later. Let's use the laser rifle for a little bit. Okay, it is getting awfully busy here. Good opportunity for that. Oh, wow. Actually, you know what? I have a grenade here somewhere. Uh, grenade. There we go. So... Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Okay. Oh! That was some good coverage. Oh, we're actually getting vultures this time. Okay. Um, note to self, next base will definitely need the uh, a roof. So, bear that in mind. Let's do the one-two punch. And a grenade. To get quiet here in a second. Ooh. Oh yeah. It's getting a little quiet. Does that mean we're done? And that was loud for a while. All the bodies. <laughs> 
so many bodies. I think we might actually be good. So what is it, 1 a.m.? I'm surprised they cleared it by 1 a.m. Usually it's uh, a little longer than that, what she said. I just dump all my stuff into there, and then we'll go check, see if there's any loot to be had. I'm gonna go ahead and say it, I missed the bags. It uh, was a, a clear definitive loot, and wasn't so much the guts, and you'd lose a lot of loot when the bodies are stacked on top of each other and you can only uh, occupy one block. So, yeah, I kind of miss the zombie bags. All right, well, that took a good long while, but I think I got all of the corpses. Just all sprinkled throughout the outer edges as well as in the pit. And this is absolutely everything we got. So we got the sniper book. Weapons do more damage when using a scope, which is a good thing. Ripplum, a harvest tool crafting, which is getting up there. Uh-huh, a couple donuts, which I will promptly reward myself with. Oh, a harpoon gun. I think, if I'm not mistaken, this is the first... Yeah, I think this is the first weapon you can craft when it comes to the heavy weapons. Yeah, harpoon enthusiasts. There we go, harpoon gun. A railway rifle, incinerator, goss rifle, and a minigun. Yeah, maybe putting points in heavy weapons might be something fun to do. All right, well, it's time to clean up it. This has been a good horde night. It was well under control. There was concerns from a few vultures. Why's my car over here? The zombies pushed it. There was concern from vultures, so uh, this is the last night we'll have in an uncovered horde base. So, yeah, that's uh, <laughs> that was a good night. You know, uh, no complaints. It went well. It's just our next base will have to be a little more, a little more protected. All right, this has been Genesis episode 21 of the Wasteland World on Fire. Like we saw here today, like the video. If you'd like to see some more in the future, consider subscribing if you haven't already. Thanks for watching, and catch us next time where we start the moving process and get our butts over to a new town, new, new adventures, and all more chaos.